Hop on, hop off. That is the idea behind the name of Milwaukee's streetcar, the hop. But Carol, you buried the lead. <laughs> For the first year, you get to ride it for free. <laughs> That's for sure. Rebecca Clough is live in downtown to explain what this announcement means for taxpayers. Well, Charles and Carol, as the tracks go down, the city says all along the idea has been to find someone to help sponsor the streetcar. Today, we found out Potawatomi and the city are going to be partners in this venture for the next decade. A new name is about to become part of Milwaukee's downtown. The name will be The Hop, presented by Potawatomi Hotel and Casino. Potawatomi will pay $10 million to cover operating costs of the streetcar for the first three years. We'll fund all the local share for operations that previously was anticipated to be covered by the parking fund. So for the 2008 budget, that will be exactly zero money going to the streetcar for operations. But some residents worry what happens after that. I don't know what, how it affects the taxes, really. That's about the main thing I worry about if I'm paying more. The mayor says when the streetcar starts up next year, it will make Milwaukee more competitive for businesses. The largest cities in this country that don't have any fixed transit are Wichita, Kansas, and Fresno, California. We see our competition as Atlanta, as, as Pittsburgh, as Minneapolis. Those are the cities we're competing with for talent. Though residents appreciate the idea of economic development, free rides for the first year on the hop make them even happier. I think that's fantastic. I'd be willing to give it a try. Now, I checked construction is actually running ahead of schedule, so they say there's no reason that the hop won't be up and running by fall of next year, right on schedule. Reporting live downtown, Rebecca Clough, today's TMJ4. We like the sound of free. Thank you, Rebecca.